Sam, I'm thinking of taking a new contract with Revel, but I can't find any dirt on them. Just a press release about a merger with Morris Modules. Not sure what happened exactly. Those module units that Morris cranks out are top shelf. So you'd think the company would be a top trade. Word is Rebel Strong armed a few Morris board members and took control of their assets. That's good info. Thanks, Sam. What's the survival rate of their contractors? I'd like to know what my odds of surviving are until my ten are up. They've had pretty solid success with relocating their contractors after they finish up. A good 60 to 70 percent of them make it through to collect. That's better than I'd hoped for. I owe you for this, bud. I'll send you a gift basket if I survive my first mission. All of the applicants are readied. I have them seated in Auditorium 04 and they are currently under supervision. There are 78 persons in total. Our psychosocial profiling matrix has recommended that only two of these persons are I know are who I want. Tell Simone, Manchester, Isaac, Bronson, and Ives to stay. Dismiss the others. Two of those candidates have criminal records. And one is presently wanted for murder in 17 provinces. Janice. Yes. Send the others home. As you wish. <laughs> May I have your attention, please? Thank you for attending our hiring fair this morning. We have concluded our screening. We would like Mr. Simone, Manchester, Isaac, Bronson, and Ives to remain. For the rest of you, I wish you good luck. That's it. Interview's over. Proceed to exit. <laughs> Okay, I'm listening. Why should I hire you? Impress me. With RC drone racing, you have handheld controllers, OSDs for things like battery telemetry and guidance. Combat drones have surveillance and combat capabilities and are controlled through a sophisticated gesture-based user interface. There is no prop or PID tuning, no prop wash, and they're far more stable with their anti-gravity magnetic propulsion systems. Two totally separate systems, but I am a master at both. The true genius of this whole thing? I mean, yeah, I gained administrative access to the internet facing scheduling system of the largest Bioware contractor on the face of the planet and siphoned off a few yettabytes of email communications. What was truly majestic was my concealment of my web shell through an auto-deletion protocol, which altered my eight-character ASPX files on their exchange server logs into a simple text file, thereby leaving their net sleuths in the dark and my trail was lost forever. It was genius, man. You know, but they called it cyber espionage. There were these spiny cat-like critters coming out of the woods, bouncing on our team. This poor bitch got mixed up with one. His throat got all tore up, blood everywhere. So there I am, rounds flying all over the place. Lighting for shit, Zeno's jumping out of the shadows. I'm trying to line up the vein ends and apply a quick suture to this poor bastard, but my hands are shaking so bad I almost tore his jugular once I got in there with my forceps. Some jarhead field doc sticks a lit cig in my mouth and tells me to suck it down. Says it'll cool my nerves. <laughs> sure as shit, I almost coughed up a lung and puked all over this guy in front of me. But my hands stopped shaking. Two drops ago, one of our guys' data pads broke on impact. Global positioning was down and our main force was out of comm range. We needed every pad we could muster to interlink at max range to create an on-surface triangulated reference to find them. But I got the hardware back up and running again with just little fiddly bits of stuff I was carrying around with me. I got lots of tools for that kind of thing, but I really could use a new U-44 plasma cutter. I've always wanted one of those. Can I get a plasma cutter from you guys? You know, if you hire me and all that. My purpose is to put people in the dirt. They made me like this through the training. It's totally legal and accepted. 
You have to break a man down before you build him back up to how you want him. I'm grateful, though. I don't know where I'd be without the military. I was proud to serve, and I did what I was told. I just wish there was something for me when I got back home, you know what I mean? I went from being a valuable asset worth millions of credits in training to a street urchin sleeping in an alley. But I'm good now, and I'm ready to get back to it. Excellent. Very thorough answers to our questions. I think we've got everything we need here. Is there anything else you'd like to add before we go? Maybe a summary statement that best encapsulates who you are? You can't rush perfection. I'm about an 8 out of 10. Writing code is not a crime. The 2250-watt laser would be fine, too. They call me the bill collector. 